Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's a girl Rachel. The weather has been so cloudy these days. You need a cup of coffee or hot chocolate to go with it. These omelets were so 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 good. I enjoyed it. Just take a look at it, please and right. So you guys, these days I've been feeling so down, anxiety here and there because it's almost two days to my birthday and this stuff keep happening to me all the time like you don't know what the future holds for you i believe the future is gonna be big because jehovah is there and all that but you know like it keeps coming like the new age like this the um work that's going to come with it and stuff so i need to release my stress i release my stress by cooking so i'm making this chinese fried rice i don't have most of the ingredients like the oyster sauce the soy sauce and the spring onion so i'm just going to work with what i have i scrambled up two eggs now i want add a little bit of cooking oil to the pot adding your onion ginger and garlic paste but i use the instant one because i don't have strength to do that then add in your carrots, your fresh scotch bonnets. Then you're just gonna fry it up for five to three minutes. They're about adding your seasoning, dry herbs. Then add in your rice. Your rice should be one day old rice. You have to put it in the fridge. It's more better that way. You can use any rice. You can work with any rice of your choice. I'm gonna add in my scrambled egg. Then I'm gonna stir fry it on low heat. For five minutes, yeah, you have to stay fried on low heat for five minutes. It's gonna bring this crispy, delicious taste out. Very nice. Yeah, I can smell it. Yeah. Mm. Right now, I'm just plating it. Take a look at it. So good. Yummy. <laughs> Let me wave. For those weeks. Let me see the woman that is with the cup of thousand dollars already. I'm 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 Look at the guy putting on green vintage. They're going to be stopping you to buy things you obviously don't want to buy. You guys need to be careful. Hold on to your belongings, your purses, your bags very tightly. We are currently approaching Makoko, Lagos, Venice. <laughs> This place accommodates over 250,000 people. It's a very big community. It is a slum. Their major occupation here is fishing. Basically, they live on water. It's a very, very big community. I can't wait to pay a visit to this place. I've stayed in Lagos all my life and I haven't visited this place. I have to go there. I'm angry. I know it's not right to be angry. Or any of this. Because I'm not right. Forget that anyways. But like what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Like, if you ask me, now who I go ask? Nigerian government, what's happening? Federal Republic of Nigerian government, what's happening? Ask me what's happening. Like, students have been home. Like they have been home since February. February, I can remember 14th or 15th of February. They have been home doing nothing. We're learning skills, doing everything. But education is our right now. Education is our right. Are we not paying money? We are paying money. We are paying money for this. On we are on strike. Like how can a whole country like ah oh God, this stuff is pissing me off. Like okay, please subscribe. Yeah, I'm begging you. Subscribe and like this video. Subscribe and like. <laughs> subscribe, 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 subscribe. Yeah? Subscribe, 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 subscribe. Thank you.
Bye. Bye.